on my face. I know, but it's so... What? Jerry Springer. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? You think I'm trashy? You punch a woman in the face. <laughs> she provoked me. Were you drunk? No. I thought you were getting it together. Don't judge me. You said she was going to take it easy. Man, Becca, why do you gotta... You can't keep doing this kind of stuff anymore, Izzy. You're not a kid. Oh, well, I didn't realize that there was a cutoff date. Well, they should be. For acting like a jackass, they should be a cutoff date. Look, I went out, I got into a fight, I thought it was a funny story, I thought you'd be amused. Well, I'm not. Yeah, clearly. I thought you were gonna go easy. That's all that you we're gonna do less of this. Too, okay? I know it's not the same situation, but it's still hard for me too. Don't do that. Do what? You're not allowed to use him as an excuse. I'm not. You're not allowed to use him as an excuse to justify your own shit! Just don't do that. Please. I wasn't doing that. Work. Uh, don't talk about that, please. Why not? You got fired. <laughs> don't tell mom. How do you even get fired from Applebee's? There's a bunch of politics. I really don't want to get into it, okay? <laughs> I wasn't using him as an excuse. I was just trying to explain how hard it is for all of us pull everything together. Izzy, please. And I didn't hit her when I was drunk. I was totally stone sober. Yeah, right. I was. I only had a soda then. Is she gonna press challenges, do you think? No. Augie would kill her. Besides, she's over at Emily. Moved out. Or their cousins or something. What are you talking about? Oh, she um moved out. Of Augie's place. Oh. They're not together anymore. I'm sorry, do you do you know these people? Augie, I do. The girlfriend I just started. What did you do, Izzy? What do you mean? To that woman, what did you do to her? I told you I just hit her. Uh, before that. Nothing, I just met her. People don't just scream in your face for no reason. Sure they do! You should get out more often. <laughs> Are you sleeping with him? This Augie guy, whatever his name is, you were sleeping with him. Where right? are you going with Well, this? Jesus, is you tell this story like you're an innocent bystander. That you had no idea who this woman was. I didn't. You were having sex with her boyfriend. And so besides the point, is it? They weren't together for a long time. They were only living together because of the rent situation. She didn't care what he did. Then why did she accost you in a crowded bar? Because she's a lunatic and because Augie told her mom was pregnant. Well, then why? Really nice guy, Becca. You're gonna really like him. He's a, he's a musician. <laughs> That's terrific. That's not what he meant. He's he gets work. He's a working musician. So is that why you came? To tell me you're pregnant? Pretty much. How long have you known? A few weeks. And you're just telling me now? Jesus, Becca. What? You didn't want to tell me? Why do you think? <laughs> Jesus, everything's so fucked up. What are you going to do? Well, I'm keeping it if that's what you're asking. I know that this may be hard for you for tons of reasons, but can I just say, I don't need any advice right now or any lectures or anything that you're proposing in your head. I just want you to pretend to be happy for me. All right, even if you're not right now, I just, I would like you to pretend to be, all right? I'm happy for you. I was just 
taking it back, that's all. Do you, uh, you think a baby's going to fulfill you or give you clarity or peace of mind or whatever it is, then obviously it's a wonderful thing. I am happy.